Ladies and gentlemen, brace yourselves for an epic journey into the twisted and thrilling world of Code Geass, Lelouch of the Rebellion. In the realm of Japanese anime, this series, often simply referred to as Code Geass, stands as a colossal creation brought to life by the visionary minds at sunrise. Directed by the maestro Guro Taniguchi and scripted by the brilliant Ichiro Okuchi, with original character designs crafted by the illustrious Clamp, Code Geass is a roller coaster of rebellion, supernatural powers, and heart wrenching drama. Picture this an alternate timeline where exiled Prince Lelouch Lamperouge emerges from the shadows, armed with the power of absolute obedience bestowed upon him by the mysterious CC. In this alternate universe, the Holy Britannian Empire reigns supreme, and Lelouch, wielding the supernatural force known as Geass, spearheads a rebellion against the oppressive empire. Strap in, because this isn't just a tale of political intrigue. It's a mecha-filled adventure with epic battles and unexpected twists. The journey begins in October 2006, as Code Geass graced the screens of MBS in Japan, captivating audiences with its mind-bending narrative. But oh, the saga doesn't end there. The sequel, Code Geass, Lelouch of the Rebellion R2, continued the rebellion as a simulcast on MBS and TBS from April to September 2008. And that's not all, this masterpiece has transcended the small screen, branching into manga and light novels, offering alternate scenarios that keep fans on the edge of their seats. Now, fast forward to 2017-2018, where the trilogy of initiation, transgression, and glorification hit the cinemas. These compilation films not only recap the events of both anime series but also toss in curveballs, altering storylines and establishing an alternate universe that adds a layer of complexity to the already intricate narrative. And just when you thought the ride was over, in February 2019, a brand new original film titled Code Geass Lelouch of the Re. Surrection hit theaters, picking up after the mind-boggling events of the film trilogy's alternate universe. But wait, there's more rebellion on the horizon. Code Geass. Z of the Recapture, an anime series set in the same alternate universe, was unveiled in December 2020 as part of a grand 10-year plan. Talk about a rebellion with longevity. Bandai Entertainment didn't just sit on the sidelines. They snatched up most parts of this captivating franchise for an English release in December 2007. The series, complete with English dubbing, galloped onto Adult Swim in the United States making it accessible to fans around the globe. Manga and light novels? Bandai has you covered there too, publishing most of them in North America, ensuring the rebellion's reach knows no bounds. Code Geass has left an indelible mark on the anime landscape, selling over a million DVD and Blu-ray discs in Japan. Awards? Oh, you betcha. Both seasons snagged accolades at prestigious events like the Tokyo International Anime Fair. Animage Anime Grand Prix, and Animation Kobe. And why not? With a gripping story, stellar voice acting, widespread audience appeal, conflicts among main characters that'll tug at your heartstrings, and moral questions that'll make you ponder, Code Geass is a tour de force that's earned its stripes. Now, let's dip our toes into the intricate plot of this alternate timeline. Picture a world divided into three superpowers, the Holy Britannian Empire, the Chinese Federation, and the Europa United. This isn't your average world, though, it's a realm where the Britannian Empire conquered Japan, renaming it Area 11 and its citizens, 11s, stripped of rights and freedom. The point of divergence? A royal twist during the reign of Queen Elizabeth I that birthed the Britannian Emperor's lineage, turning the geopolitical tides. Enter Lelouch v Britannia, an exiled prince harboring deep resentment toward his father, Emperor Charles Z. Britannia. The brutal murder of his mother, Marianne V. Britannia, and the traumatizing aftermath for his sister Nunnally set the stage for Lelouch's burning desire for revenge. Political pawns in the grand chessboard of Britannian machinations, Lelouch and Nunnally are sent to Japan, where Britannia's assault leads to defeat and devastation. Fast forward seven years, and Lelouch, now masquerading as Lelouch Lamperouge, is an enigmatic student at Ashford Academy. A chance encounter with a mysterious girl named C.C. Grants Lelouch the power of Gios, an ability to command anyone to obey his will, with direct eye contact. Thus, Zero is born, 
a masked vigilante leading the resistance, the Black Knights, in a quest to obliterate Britannia and create a world where Nunnally can find happiness. However, as Lelouch delves deeper into the chaos, conflicts arise with Suzaku, a member of the resistance named Colin Statfeld, and even his own half-siblings. The battleground is set, featuring mecha showdowns, political intrigue, and a struggle that will reshape the world itself. Caught in a conflict where the true extent of his powers remains shrouded, Lelouch's journey as Zero becomes a breathtaking saga that will forever echo in the annals of anime history. So there you have it, dear anime aficionados. A glimpse into the expansive universe of Code Geass. With its gripping narrative, mesmerizing characters, and a touch of the supernatural, this series has etched its name among the anime greats. Prepare to be captivated, enthralled, and possibly left pondering the moral complexities of rebellion in this extraordinary alternate reality.